Welcome back, tech enthusiasts. In today's video, we're diving into the world of AWS RDS to uncover the key differences between multi-AZ deployments and read replicas. If you're wondering which database replication solution is right for you, you're in the right place. Let's get started. Multi-AZ Deployments AWS RDS Multi-AZ Deployments provide high availability by replicating your database across multiple availability zones. In this setup, a primary database instance is synchronously replicated to a standby instance in a different AZ in the event of a failure. Amazon RDS automatically promotes the standby instance to become the primary, ensuring seamless failover without data loss. Read Replicas on the other hand, AWS RDS read replicas focus on scalability and offloading read traffic from the primary database. Read replicas asynchronously replicate data from the primary instance, allowing you to horizontally scale your database to handle read-heavy workloads. This means you can distribute the read requests across multiple replicas, reducing the load on the primary instance and improving performance. Replication lag one crucial difference between multi-AZ deployments and RID replicas is the concept of replication lag. In multi-AZ deployments, data replication is synchronous, ensuring that the standby instance is always up to date. However, in RID replicas, the replication is asynchronous, resulting in a slight delay known as replication lag. This means that RID replicas might not have the absolute latest data but are generally just a few moments behind the primary instance. Failover and High Availability When it comes to failover and high availability, both multi-AZ deployments and RID replicas offer solutions. Multi-AZ deployments provide automatic failover with minimal downtime, making them suitable for applications that require continuous availability. On the other hand, RID replicas do not offer automatic failover. However, you can manually promote a RID replica to become the primary if needed. Use cases and workload patterns. The choice between multi-AZ deployments and RID replicas largely depends on your specific use case and workload patterns. Multi-AZ deployments are ideal for applications that require maximum availability and protection against infrastructure failures. On the other hand, read replicas are well suited for read heavy workloads, reporting applications, and scenarios where scalability is crucial. And there you have it, the key differences between AWS RDS multi-AZ deployments and read replicas. As you evaluate your database replication needs, consider the specific requirements of your application and choose the solution that aligns with your goals. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more insightful tech content. If you have any questions or want to share your experience, feel free to leave a comment below. Thanks for watching. Happy database replication.